Like, I don't, I'm not trying to listen to that in my hype matches. Yeah, exactly. All right, here we go. This is your winner's finals, T and Mars. Let's get the show underway. Oh, you know why I thought this was a run back? Because Mars played the other T. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that was really smart, actually. Just stayed right behind the trampoline. There was not enough space for Mars to really do anything about it, so he just had to wait it out. Bruh, he just grabbed him through the Hydra. That hy that uh, Plasma Whip does not care. Yeah, neither does Pac-Man's uh, Galaga grab either. It just, everyone just goes through it. It's like no one cares about it. Wow! <laughs> First and third hit of up B. Use the thing in neutral to actually get out of that situation. Okay, I like the, uh, how um, Mars is punishing the Hydrant um, spawns. He's uh, very smart. Like, a second he sees T try to spawn a Hydrant low to the ground, he meets him with a neutral air and is able to knock him right off his feet. Mm -hmm. That's a really great thing you can do with kickflip pressure. You can just go right in front. Ooh. Oh, wow. Okay. Miss Tech into Bell into Force Smash. I can't even compliment Mars. He's like, no, 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 no. You're trying to talk about me, right? Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. All right, really smart by Mars there, actually w patiently waiting the Galaxian ship and picking it up himself. Yo! Okay. He yeah. definitely wanted that. I mean, I think he could have gotten that spike, that dare spike hitbox if he had just landed on the stage too, but it just kind of overshot the lip and yeah. fell to his own doom. Maybe he didn't even mean to do that. Maybe he tried to do a runoff air. <laughs> <Just, laughs> Mars just kind of looked like, what? It was like, Oops. He definitely <laughs> didn't mean to do that, obviously, SD is stock. So well, I, I wonder what, what he was trying to do there. Galaga, or excuse me, Galaxian comes back up. Yeah, just uh, using that Hydrant, just keeps him off stage, puts the pressure on. Apple uses uh -oh. the Z drop too to cover behind him just in case Mars is able to go through. He's not able to go in reversal on a punish and get positioning because of it. Mars patiently waiting right here, tries to apply pressure with the down smash. Yo, the stage spike with the runoff back air. So T quick. not going to be ready for it. Yeah, so quick from Mars. I guess T wasn't expecting him to actually go down there in punishment in right. the time that he had it. And so he just wasn't ready for the tech that time either. Nice forward tilt actually catching him. And the Tyrant coming right at Mars as well. I like that attempt. Trying to use the bell to elicit some pressure and make it so that he doesn't try to hit the Hydrant back at him before he even gets to approach. But T was ready for it. And I gotta say, man, despite this percent deficit for Mars, he's definitely looking pretty comfortable in the matchup, not kind of getting, like, thrown off by a lot of uh, Pac-Man's tricks. Let's jump, though. Oh, the force smash will beat out the whip. They're fighting over the Hydrant right now. Oh, Dang. yeah, he tried to hit it the last moment, but you gotta be careful if Pac-Man is charging behind it. He just toss it out any time. And that's what we were talking about earlier with the Hydrant being such a good tool in the neutral. It just kind of like, it controls space for Pac-Man, allowing him to do other things while his opponent is focused on either beating out the Hydrant or maneuvering around it. Right. So game one going to T right there. Mm hmm Dang, man. See, Shut Shutan isn't even in the bracket. Anymore. I know. That's crazy. That's wild. Right, here we go. Moving on to Smash Hill. I guess this is a really comfortable stage for Mars. He's been counterpicking this stage pretty much every time. Yo, he just ran up in his face and grabbed him. All right. I'm sorry for saying your grab is bad, T. I get it. <laughs> we, we, it's like we have a couple of, <laughs> of misconceptions we'd like to clear up here in this match. <laughs> but a quick parry into Jab. Keeping all the pressure. That was a great corner carry, actually, reading the T's defensive options. Down smash, not able to do it. Oh, but kick flip. That will be able to get the spike. That was the perfect spacing for it. Yeah, beautiful conversion off of the neutral air. I'm definitely taking one of those. All right. Gets the juggles to the up airs. All right, falling up air into up smash. Potentially tries to find a read on the defensive option. Not quite going to be able to find it. Wow, what a great lead for Mars right here. Flip jumping back to the ledge. Yo, oh my god. Two for two right there? Yes. <laughs> and that was really like cool the way he did it too because he just stood on the hydrant uh, waiting for a reaction from T off the ledge and he just jumped off, hit him with the neutral air, got the flip kick into it. Mm -hmm. 
Dang, really strong lead for Mars. 112% on his first stock here still. Trying to put time to tech, tech chase, but Bell was in hand. You got to be careful about that. Is If you're pressing too many buttons and you're point blank on your opponent, especially as Pac-Man, uh, you can get blown up like that. 100%, man. Up throw into the up air. Okay, he tried to read a, a defensive option, uh, an air dodge into the ground potentially, but the grab not going to work out. And that's what we're talking about, man. That a grab, you just have to be like playing steps ahead with it. You can't react to your opponent with that grab as like must, most other characters would. Yeah. I'm trying to bait out something. That down smash was misspaced, so I feel like he was trying to be right outside of like a get up attack or something like that. Not able to find it though. Ooh! Oh, on the hydrant? Yeah, fighting on the smallest stage possible. The hydrant. <laughs> I'm loving it, man. Oh! Okay, he finally he finally finds it. He was looking for that back air off stage every time, and I guess he found his opportunity. He's like, oh, you're charging fruit, huh? <laughs> well, it would be ashamed if my foot hit your face. Yeah, I, was, I wasn't sure who died, man. <laughs> I was like, yo, the melon? <laughs> yeah. Coming through? <laughs> Mars was up a stock. That's, why I yeah, That's the only right, reason why I yeah, know. Right. It's like, let me hit your face. That also happens to be your whole body for some reason. Dang, man. <laughs> Tragedy. Yeah. Alrighty. Ooh. Pac-Man is just a whole hurt box. Mm -hmm. Mars taking that get right there. Can't be things even. 1-1. One, 1-1 one. One one here in this winner's final. It's going to final destination. Yo, okay. He tried to run in his face. Hit him with the run-up grab again. And T said, none of that, sir. Mm -hmm. Have the plasma whip. Ooh, up till Juggles gets 29% off of it. Almost had caught him in the air. I thought he was going to pull out a back air to be able to cover the side of him, but I guess he thought maybe he was going to go for a double jump or something. Whew, he almost got that too, but the uh, up air was able to beat it out. Back throw, DI's out. Smart from T. Oh, he had already fallen out of the Paralyzer, but he was not ready to react. Got hit by the forward smash anyways. Yeah. Mars pulling up a stock. Pretty much full charge. That was really great for Mars. Yeah, and I mean, it's, it, that, that's what I mean. Like, it, because Mars was fully charged and T had already, like, fell out of the Paralyzer, mm -hmm. that was, like, an extra opportunity for him to actually escape the kill, right. but yeah. he just was not ready. Mm -hmm. Double laser, still not enough to <laughs> take out the Hydrant. That would be a forward smash. Cross country? No, not quite. Not enough. 116% on Mars here. Oh, the grab. Getting him hit by another forward smash. Oh, wow. He actually reversed it oh, and brought okay. it back around for the toss. Very smart stuff. Oh, my God, man. Mars is really trying to end these stocks all the time with the back airs. MVP for him right now. Yeah, T's just going at a distance very low where Mars is a little bit hesitant to try and go down there for the edge guard. Hanging on the ledge, not able to use anything to really hit below it. <laughs> I forget that Pac-Man actually has a crawl. Why? <laughs> <laughs> Why not? Why not, yeah. Why does Inkling have a crawl when You're she right. has the best dash dance in the game? <laughs> <laughs> I thought that was the funniest thing when I first found out. I was yeah. like, yo, okay, sure. <laughs> mm -hmm. This character's not top tier. Yeah. All right. Fairs, tra trace them off stage. All right, what's the grab going to be? Put them off stage one more time with the fair. Or excuse me, fourth throw. Finally takes it from across the stage with that kickflip. That took forever to try and take T-Stock. He was really on it with the survivability and just avoiding all of Mars' setups. Okay, T with the bell in hand right here. That's going to be a setup uh, we're going to see a lot. Bell into the forward smash, but I was always saying the uh, bell into the hydrant, actually. It, it definitely makes it a really dangerous area of effect for his opponent to maneuver around, and the uh, bell pretty much sends the hydrant flying right away. Yeah, it's such a deadly item to yeah. have. It's just like one toss and you're dead, especially at that percent. Like... Why not, man? I'll take that. Up throw up there. Okay, T back in this game right now. Oh, the, the strawberry actually covering the, the area above the hydrant. Catching Mars, trying to use aerials to try and catch the, the hydrant, it looks like. Yeah, this is a difficult part for Mars. It's like, all right, Pac-Man has the lead, and he's throwing out the hydrant to control the stage. How do I get back into the game? without him throwing fruits over or under the hydrant just for me to go uh, <laughs> and try and get some damage in. 
Okay, getting the grab, distracting Mars with the Hydrant. Yeah, it's like every time the Hydrant's out, you can tell Mars is just trying to play the game of how do I get around it. Yes. And none of Zero Suit's aerials really have that much damage output right. to be able to meet the Hydrant head. Yeah. The Hydrant Threshold <laughs> and the ZSS will die to the key cross stage too. Oh man, that's how it be, man. Pac-Man has too much stuff, so much going on, it really mixes you up and it, it gets you all tongue twisted. Yeah. But T, on his second game victory here in, in, uh, in this set. Yeah. Potentially or one yeah. game away from moving into Grand Finals. Their side. You know, if a Pac-Man straight up wins an MSM, I don't know what I'd do That's with crazy. myself at the point. <laughs> Olimar, Olimar won a saga, and then immediately afterwards, Pac-Man? Yeah. It's like, yo, what? It's like, oh, God. What time we're, we're, It's like, we're, we're letting the projectile win characters win, guys. <laughs> but here we go. Oh, but you know what? That doesn't matter when you get in there to kickflip. It's such a low percent. It was like 40, yeah, dude. dude it, that's exactly how the last game started as well. Mars opening up with a really explosive stock. Uh, nonetheless, we saw how it went, and T was able to bring it back and win the game. Yeah, and I think that just has a big thing to do with the, just the size of the stage. This is like Mars is in a position to choke their opponent at the, uh, at the edge of the stage more often because of the size of uh, Smashville. Oh, that was a beautiful whip right there. Puts himself to the ledge, gets flip kick, punished for that somewhat greedy forward smash. Yeah. If you're pressing the buttons on the ledge against Zero Suit, it's kind of difficult. Yo, okay, Mars. He just spammed down there at the ledge and then boost kicked out of there, yo. That was third level conditioning. It was <laughs> like, all right. That was hardcore. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I mean, Mars doesn't have to really do anything. He can just avoid that Hydrant. Because he was on a deficit before on the last game. But now he doesn't have to worry about it. He can just use his movement, frustrate T, and just make T play his game rather than the other way around. It's been going on for most of the set. Yeah, up air, getting T out of a really bad situation. And a second up air securing the stock. He's got two more to go here. Yeah, that was interesting. Using the, like, a yeah. wave, wave dash out of the... Uh, Hydrant water. Yeah, that was cute. Good job. Yeah, I like that. He'd recognize he had the key in hand, so it decides to respect it and just be in the space where he'll be right above it if he tries to do ledge jump key. Yeah, interestingly enough, Mars was at zero percent, so the key probably would have just racked up a little bit of damage. Mm -hmm. Yeah, nothing and to really be worried about. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, dare to run up boost kick? That does it. Okay, game five. Nice. Got what that, I wanted. <laughs> that happened so fast. I was like, Got whoa, he's going wow, to go continue into it. Wow. Nice stuff overall. Oh. Dang, man. Vance really cheering against America, man. <laughs> it's like, it. come on, guys. Can you root for your country? <laughs> giving giving the other T hugs. Rooting for t this T. It's like, come on, bro. He, he, it's like he, he mains Link. You're supposed to be, you're supposed to be cheering for the other Link. Yeah. <laughs> other T. Did you get your T's mixed up, dude? <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Winner's finals. Oh, wow. Parry into up tilt. Wow, I, that actually did it for the Fire Hydrant head threshold. I'm surprised. Yeah, it even has two hits to um, deal with the Hydrant. So maybe that's potentially something that... Mars is going to start to use more. Huh. Uh, it was like the first time we'd actually seen an up tilt on the Hydrant. Mm -hmm. I legit thought we were going to see a Smash 4 combo happen, but you know what? Those those days are over, it looks they like. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> eat the pellet? Eat the pellet. Oh. Now okay. Eat the pellet? Yeah. yeah dude. <laughs> He's like, I'm going to get this stock first, dog. <laughs> yeah. A lot of times they get distracted by eating the pellet, and then they just get the, the damage racked up back from what they right. gained from the Two pellet. Twofold, right? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> But that time, Mars is like, I'm going to ignore this pellet, and then I'm going to go ahead and get the, the kill for it. And he's really steamrolling T at this point, overlapping the percents already. Got that ledge control, catches him on the jump. Will he get the edge guard? No, doesn't catch the directional air dodge at the end. Oh my god, he just ran up in the shield, tried to get an F smash read. They're back on the stage, but how does he get back? That's what I'm talking about. Mars can just pressure with safe aerials and space so well. As long as he has the lead, then he doesn't have to worry about the Hydrant and trying to approach T and making himself unsafe with these aerials. 
All right, T already at a massive deficit here, 125% on his second stock. Mars barely passing the 100% mark just now. Yeah, Mars is getting kind of greedy. I mean, he, he has the he stock lead, so he, it, yeah. yeah, exactly. Okay, but finally the back air will be able to close it out. Mars with a very wide deficit between him and his opponent. Oh, and the Plasma Whip catching T as he was grabbing onto the ledge, actually popping him up into the Blast Zone. Down to his last life now. Will Mars be able to take it and put himself in Grands? Yeah, looking a little grim here. Might be NA actually taking <laughs> MSM today if this keeps up because he's looking very nice right now. Up throw, okay. Not able to find anything else though. And the Hydrant is just gonna fade away. It doesn't quite get into the tumble state yet. Wait just a minute, <laughs> T. Looking like he's trying to bring this back around. Oh, he's 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 definitely plotting, man. Yeah. Trying to get that pivot. Yo. Okay, the other F smash still okay. not going to be able to do it. Another one of those will put him back into the game. Bell into up smash. Only 40% down here. That's nothing. As soon as he had the control and he was charging up the fruit, oh I was like, yeah, God, yeah he's definitely going to get the bell. And wow. All right. right. Yeah. He put himself back. Galaxian ship into the hydrant, man. And that dealt so much damage onto Mars. Dead even percent here. Forget what I said about he can afford it <laughs> if he goes for yeah. these risks. Looks like all of a sudden this lead is fading away. Gets that trade, but Fair 1 is going to lose out to Pac-Man's Fair 1 instead. Which fruit he goes for? The melon! <laughs> the pressure with the slow movement. Uses that to protect himself too. Mars still trying to bring this back. Only 1% separating these two and it's just continuing thinking he can get the berry out of it. But he's going to come back into the air, gets that Hydrant. The bell is in hand. One punish, one throw, one anything from Mars at the wrong spot will mean the set and grand finals. T winner Ooh. side for T, and he gets the Hydrant on the oh. other side. And T is totally baiting uh, Mars right here. He's got the key. Is he going to toss it in the Hydrant? No, he's avoiding it. He knows. He knows exactly how, he knows how he's going to die to that. I mean, Tries to go reading on the high. The boost kick. Is that enough? He doesn't find it. He gets the corner DI out of it. Tries to go ham off stage, but he's able to come back with the kick flip. Okay, makes it safely back <gasps> to the stage. Oh, he falls out of the Plasma <laughs> Whip. But the back here going to be able to secure that game. And Mars is going to take it in a super close Game number five. Oh, yeah, I thought it was, all, I thought it was, was about to be almost tragic. He had the read on that.